still are gonna open. I mean, it's nice and empty in here. Doesn't the elevator one open? Then we can have good fun elevator times with real elevator action. Oh, what's that coming right at me? Um, what is that? Huh. Yeah. Well, not exactly uh, sure how I'm supposed to be feeling about that right now. Is that Rouge's theme song from Sonic Adventure 2? That is Rouge's theme song from Sonic Adventure 2. Well, I mean, you can expect weirder things in these days, I guess. <laughs> oh, it disappeared. I wonder if this way to make this elevator go faster. I mean, you wouldn't think it would take this long between floors. I guess it does, though. Just gotta walk around the room and pass time. Just a few moments between every door. Okay. <laughs> this is kind of a catchy tune. <laughs> However, though, where are we in, like, robot hell or something? I've waited in stranger elevators. At least that's what I tell myself. <sighs> I don't even know what song this is. What the? Oh, Ram person joined. Hi. Sometimes. I dream about cheese. Like a true motherfucker. You know, it'd be fun if I could. What's this? Living a life of crime, he waits in his office in the downpour of salvation. Is he? Simply a misunderstood badass. Or a man waiting for the pizza delivery guy. Maybe he's a creeper creeping out of his windows. Or possibly he's just curious what's on the other side of the street. He is. Well, him. I don't know who he is. Yo, hey, look, someone else just spawned right in front of my eyes. The song isn't it, but it kind of sounds like a Daft Punk song. What time is it? Huh. 12, almost 12.45 a.m. Just while well, I explain my night's doing. Sitting in an elevator. <coughs> yep. It's kind of funny, though, that I have a human arm. But then I have zombie feet. Uh -huh. It's because I have a zombie model on, so the arm looks out of place. It'd be funny if I had like some other model that just pulled it out. Also, if you say like error textures or just more simply like those error messages or the purple plaid stuff, that's because this all is uh, basically I don't have Half-Life 2 Episode 2. I have every other piece of Half-Life thing, like I have Half-Life 2, I have Half-Life 2 Episode 1. Wow. Oh, it really is sucking me in. Okay, I don't want to get sucked into space. Do I? One more time. No! One more time. Yeah! Yeah. I yayed that yay out. Let's dance with him. <sighs> yeah. You know, if I invited Ian to this elevator, or maybe Brooke, or I could even invite someone like Fuzzle, or we could have fun times with Egg Dude, we could just sit here in this elevator and be chill and be like, yo, what's up? And they'd be like, nothing much, I'm sitting here in this elevator. And they'd be like, yeah, I'm in this elevator too. It's like, yeah, dude, I know, because you're standing right next to me. And I'd be like, oh, that means we're having 
elevator buddies. Party. Yeah. If only I could dance. I can try. Party's over. Alas. Why must all good things come to an end? See, how do you, like, do that to someone? Like, he just physically assaulted that guy on the elevator. Because I'm not a caring person. I'm just sitting here in the corner. I'm like, yep, you kicked the guy. That's assault. Not gonna do anything about it, though. It's not my duty as a zombie. Or as he likes to say... Zombies! Zombies. Umbrella created the zombies. And those zombies were what made us who we are today. Midnight, would you become my knight made of shining armor? Yes, you would. Yes, you would very much, Pilgrim. How about you, 006 by killer? You almost make me think of the anime, 007. My brother, not 007, 009. Oh, yes, this is how you have a party with, with, the, with, the, with the pilgrims. Wait, no, those aren't pilgrims. Those are, those are uh, George Washington and uh, George Lucas. George Washington and George Lucas formed together to make the United Star Wars. The United Star Wars is a uh, land of freedom. And Jar Jar Binks. Jar Jar Binks is a, he's, he's a very wise, wise, wise cactus. He's one of those cactuses, you see. That's why he is known as Jar Jar Binks of George Washington and George Lucas fame. I don't even know that much about Star Wars. I'm bullshitting here. My best friend John, he knew all about Star Wars. That isn't me though. The truth of it be, John left for Brazil for two years. I won't be able to see him until October in 2013. It's a religious journey thing, but I'll be waiting for him when he comes back. Hopefully, I mean, I do. I am actually moving to an apartment this summer, but I do think that's gonna still be here in Portland. So if nothing in my situation changes in like the next year year and a half, or two years, year and a half, then, uh, yeah, I'll be able to say, hi, Johnny boy, and you'd be like, Ryan, I haven't seen you in two years, but, like, yeah, it's because you went on that, on that religious journey, and then he'd be like, yeah, but he has to do it, he's at the coming of age, age of 20, alas, that's just how John is, hmm, oh, what's in here, nothing, well, that's kind of disappointing, well, you're entering into a zone, not very much different from our own. In it. Uh, where do these bones come from? What the? The walls are reforming! And then all the bones disappeared. That's okay, I didn't need any bones anyway. Ah. <sighs> Those bones are just not for me, I guess. I wanted to pick them up, and maybe I could chew on them like a dog. Be like, hur, hur, hur. But nope. Well, apparently humans can't do that. Well, actually, I'm not a human. I'm a zombie. Yeah, why didn't they leave me a brain or two? So I go like, nom, 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 nom. And then it'd just be like human jelly. Human pudding. Human pudding gel. Jelly pud. Someone should make that like their username on YouTube. Jelly pud. It's pudelicious. Or maybe it'd be more like puddinglicious, because it's a it's just how it is. All the same. See, how do you slap people like that? Why hello there. Oh, uh, um he hello? Who 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 uh, Claire? As in Claire Redfield? Is she in the game? No, I guess she's an NPC. I know NPCs could hop on these elevator things. Claire! Claire! I can see your ear. Claire! Claire! When you get really close to Miles and Gmod and all that, they look really freaky. Fill in your time with enjoyment of Claire's natural features. Why, hello there, Claire! I think she's special! In all the weirdest ways. 
Do 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 do. Oh, looks like they've been having their close time as well. You know, I feel like I've been experiencing something here as zero zero six spy kill or and and uh, midnight have been having their bonding times. Yeah, he's a spy killer. How's it like being a spy killer? And Jesus. Is that you over there, Morgan Freeman? Nope. It's just a man in a floaty. A badass floaty, I might add. It's got stars on it. That's how you know he's a true badass. If you see a badass in a pair of star jeans, then you know you got yourself a badass. If you want to go out on that star-bangled shirt, you do so, because then people know you're badass. Stop looking at me like that. Yeah. Spooky skeletons. Something, something evil. Uh, I do like. I'm more interested in songs that aren't just like songs on repeat involving the good old times. Like, 